Hi guys, once again this is Alfred from BinaryOptionsTutor.com I'm here with a little trade. You can see I'm selling uh, 0610 on the Euro USD. I've got about three minutes left. I'm looking for this pop. I'm looking for um, pullback to get back down below. Uh, our strike of 0610, uh, we bought something that was pretty deep out of the money our price pretty deep out of the money uh i'm sorry really we sold at 75 cent now uh, we got two minutes and something here and we're gonna see if we can get this back in the money uh get it enough for an early sale uh, before our time elapses or, you know, maybe we'll uh, ride this puppy all the way to the end. This is not a money contract. That's why I, uh, we're only betting one. <laughs> you can see the guys uh, really battling back and forth here. As we try and see if we can get this puppy in the money they're just really rejecting over here on this uh, market maker not offering us anything they're still holding out our time is winding down now this is where we've just actually uh, basically came into the money I'd like to see a little more over here Not really a lot offered, but you know what? Well, I would have took it, <laughs> even though that's not a lot. <laughs> now, we're going to have to wait it out, but we did get the pop that we were hoping for. And uh, sometimes it's just, you know, it's liquidity. Uh, the market makers will, uh, they'll leave. And uh, like I said, I, I probably would have left with that little 10 cent. You know, my risk was like a quarter. <laughs> so I would have left with the 10. Uh, we got a pop at that last minute. So... If this puppy holds, then it'll be a bid that I got in literally for a quarter. And there it goes. A trade that I got in literally for a quarter uh, that expired it at a dollar. So that's a significant that's a significant win. It's because we were trading out of the money. Same setup as I mentioned earlier. There's our red on top. There's our uh, yellow in the middle. Our blues on bottom. So, of course, the very second we see red on top, we're looking for a... We're looking for uh, looking for <laughs> sorry, so much in my ear today is bothering me. Okay, we see red on top and we're obviously looking to go short. Um, some great distance here between our red a moving average and our yellow moving average um, can instantly spot those uh, this uh, S1 here which is telling me that today this is a down day so you pull it up there central pivot 
there's this one uh, glossing back looking over the flow of the day we can see a lot of impulsive trading to the downside and we were just we're doing out of the money which are highly risky uh, but <laughs> we're trading with the flow of the market and using this same little chart uh, to gauge momentum and uh, that was it that was about a 400 percent trade uh, I'm just trading over here for fun if I were to scale what I was doing up I really like to trade uh, a mixture of in the money at the money and out of the money and the deeper I go in the money and the deeper I go out of the money I like to scale back the number of contracts is a general rule if you can stick to that it's going to um, basically uh, help you without a lot of calculations to uh, get get the math and keep the math on your side long term that's basically all I had uh, to share with you guys today. Just a really quick out of the money trade. Um, we got in. It worked. Um, so one of the pluses of trading on an exchange is there are opportunities for you to get in selling at 75 like I did there and get 300% profit as opposed to some of the lower fixed profits of trading. Uh, on the the other EU style platforms. That's all I had guys. Uh like, share, comment, subscribe. Once again this is Alfred from binaryoptionstutor.com.